German 6th Army had advanced to the suburbs of Stalingrad by August 1942. Luftwaffe General Martin Fiebig's Flieger Corps or Air Corps 8 was tasked in July 1942 with providing air support for the German 6th Army as it captured Stalingrad. Fiebig's superior, General Oberst Wolfram von Richthofen, concentrated all its efforts on Stalingrad. Logistics for Flieger Corps 8 received the highest preference, as Richthofen saw the capture of Stalingrad as the key to German success on the entire Eastern Front. On 21st of August, Richthofen personally flew across the Don and was shocked at the carnage of dead Soviet bodies and destroyed tanks. Flieger Corps 8 flew 1,600 unbroken sorties, blasting a path for the German Panzer spearheads by dropping 1,000 tons of bombs on the 23rd of August. Junkers GU-87 Stuka dive bombers and medium bombers bombed and paralyzed Soviets, landed, refueled, restruck their ordnance and flew more missions, as the German aircraft never broke the cycle. Flieger Corps 8 lost only three aircraft that day, while destroying 91 Soviet aircraft in a single day. It was only the first half of Flieger Corps 8's attack that day, as the second great air offensive of the 23rd of August was carried out against the city of Stalingrad itself. From 3 p.m. on the 23rd of August 1942 and through the night into 24th of August, units of Flieger Corps 8 constantly attacked the city. During 23rd of August, the German Air Force flew approximately 1,600 sorties and dropped 1,000 tons of bomb on the city, effectively destroying it, while three aircraft were lost. Buildings crumbled under the blast effects of high explosives. Stalingrad was enveloped in dense, volcano-like black clouds of smoke that stretched 3,500 meters into the sky. After the 23rd of August, Stalingrad was bombed block by block for a further five days. According to official statistics, 90 German planes were shot down in addition to 30 by anti-aircraft defense. After another day of heavy bombing on the 24th of August, Richthofen on the morning of 25th of August flew personally over the city to watch the great fire attack of the day. He later wrote that the city was completely destroyed without any worthwhile further targets. On the 30th of August, Richthofen, believing the fall of Stalingrad to be imminent, ordered fresh terror attacks on the city to break the Soviet will to resist. That day and the next, Flieger Corps 8 launched full-scale bombing operations against the city, also attacking Soviet airfields east of the Volga to maintain German air superiority. Luftwaffe fear or Air Fleet 4 defeated the Red Air Force in the airspace above the city, restricting the Soviets to night operations. Over the course of the battle through the late 1942, the Germans flew 70,000 sorties, dropping over a million bombs. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and support my channel on PayPal. Details in the description box.